over the Roseville Road uh, kind of homeless area situations that's been oh. for a long time. <laughs> and, uh, this, there's still some person, some people that are still living out here. Uh, uh, we came up upon uh, one gentleman, his name is Mike. Uh, we're going to go in and, and talk to him again. And he's in uh, need of uh, some roof repair, right? You want to go outside? Oh, uh, yeah, here we go. Okay. Right. It's just because it's so freaking long. I know, right? Yeah. Do anything with the ditch here? I didn't notice if it leaked yet or not. I'm sure it did. That back corner over there is really bad. Um, but I tried to fix it up, you know. As you can. Every year at least, you know. Well, Jay's going to go on up and, and see what uh, what you need, okay? okay? You have a metal roof, right? Um, no. You have a rubber roof? Well, like, it's basically the same as the it's a fiberglass roof. Okay, good. Well, that will be exciting. We'll, we'll go up there. Let's do an inspection first. Um, that be all right? Yep. You need a hand with this? Uh, okay. Yeah, they didn't mess around, huh? They got you a ladder, all right. And then, uh, uh, yeah, I haven't. Here, sit now. Yep. Here. So how are things going? What's what's been happening? Are they is the city moving you around? Yeah, pretty much. You're right, they're keeping you in motion? Right. Where were you living before? Well, um, way out um, uh, oh shoot. How ran and Oh you're out there. And I was staying out there and then it got carried away, people out there got you know, the garbage and the trash. And oh, yeah. So. Yours looks really uh, well kept. You, you keep it up. You don't have a lot well, of trash. Yeah, all I was working on it this morning. Um, okay. I didn't quite get finished. I got to go get a rake. But, you know, I get tired of tripping over the stuff in it. I know it's not mine, but still. It's, it's on this earth, and I am too. And then, yeah. You know, I'd rather not look at it if I didn't have to. Right. So. Are you getting any? <laughs> well, I noticed a couple things going on, but that's uh, manageable. You know, you get some new tape on there, so it's not too bad, right? It could be worse. Every little hole is, you know, definitely water. Right. Are you getting any Social Security? Yeah, I am. Okay, good. I am. All right. So you have some income. Okay, good. Well, we're starting uh, for the winter season here, reaching out to people and seeing how we can help them out. Uh, and yours is, uh, I'm sure glad that we that he knocked on your door, because it's always good to see you. And you come in, you're one of our customers, so it's oh, yeah. it's really good. You're the only place in town really you like to shop. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's, uh, I'm going to shoot up there and see what we have to look at, okay. and then we'll go from there. I think we should go off of what you, uh, this is an interesting uh, thing. They definitely put some coating up here. But I can't really tell what is what's underneath it. I don't think it's metal. Um, but you said it's leaking back here. Yeah, that's been the worst area. Right here. Yeah, I patched it, patched it. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and do some die core sealant right along here. I can definitely feel air pockets. Yeah. You have a, you actually have a hole right here. Right there. That you, you definitely have a hole. You can see that. Yeah. The problem is, then maybe just do a, a close inspection along there. Yep. Okay, the inside looks fine. The inside square looks fine. Okay. Should I take this uh, up with you? If, when you're ready to apply, mm -hmm. just um, let, us, let me know and I'll... Right, I'll I'm go there and clean it up. First. Okay. All right. All right, so we have an exposed gap right here completely into uh, into the roof area. So Jay's going to go ahead and throw on a uh, Dicor product. 
which is a self-leveling uh, roof seal or a sealant, and then it uh, it'll just spread itself out. You can see a lot of uh, texture on here, so this has been mopped on there pretty thick. It's hard to tell what's underneath there. We're probably thinking a piece of aluminum. Um, okay, so Mike's got a lot of holes going on here, Jay, inside the wall. Can't hear because of the train. We're all good. Is he going to bite? Hi, baby. Good to have you. Okay, good. So we're all done on top. He'll come back uh, at a later time before the rains and, and do that sidewall. Okay. That sound good? Thank you very much. All right, brother. You be safe. Nice to meet you, Mike.